Hi learners, welcome to my channel Data Science University with MLV Prasad. The agenda for today's video is Project 2 Panda Sleep Code Question Type Easy 1587 Bank Account Summary 2. The GitHub link for the solution is provided in the description below. You can join my Telegram community for further updates and discussion. Scan here to join the community. The link is also provided in the description below. Now, let's solve together the problem. Okay. Here, they have given some users table where some customers of a bank are available here. Account number 90,000, 1 or 9 lakh or something. It is allies. Similarly, uh, some another customer, 9 lakh to Bob, 9 lakh 3, Charlie. Similarly, what is the transaction done by each customer also has been given. Okay. Transaction 1 done by this customer. What is the amount on which date he has done? Okay. Now what they want to do? Write a solution to report the name and balance of users with a balance higher than 10,000. Okay. Now let us come here. The balance of an account is equal to the sum of amounts of all transactions involving that account. Okay. No issue. Let us come here. Okay, now we can observe. We have these accounts and this account to be connected in both the tables. Okay, now we can see this is connected to this one. Now, this Bob is connected to this one. Now Charlie is connected to this one. Okay. What is the sum of amount for allies? This is the sum. What is the sum of amount for Bob? This is the sum. What is the sum of amount for this one? This is the one. So what I need to do, combine these two tables using account ID, account and account. Next, a group by this account comma name and do the sum of amount this should be my step two step one should be this one my step three should be filter for the sum of amount which is greater than 10k okay hope it's clear for everyone let's code it up now let's say df is equal to let's connect these two tables users dot merge transactions I want only the common columns in there how they are connected account ID account right side table also account now let us run it Okay, now we have got the merge table. Now what I want, for each name, I want the balance. But there is an issue. Let us assume 9,000, 9,1 is there, 9,3 is there. Both are having the same name allies. Then if you group by what will happen, these two accounts will be clubbed up. So to overcome this issue, I will do it by the combination of both account comma name to avoid the duplicacy issue and I will use the amount column and I will do the sum okay as it is a group by object that group by object I will convert into a data frame using this okay now you can see clearly what is the thing which is there let me call it as df only now from this df table 
I want only the DF table where DF of amount is greater than 10,000 okay clear now I don't want all the columns I want only the name and amount column But they are calling the new names name balance dot rename columns name name amount balance That's it. Now let me check for all the test cases. Looks like it is running for all the success, uh, test cases successfully and we have solved the problem. I will explain one more time. There are two tables, users and transaction. Now for each name, the customer name, I want the sum of amount. As the two things are connected using account ID, I have combined them first using account ID. Okay. And for each name I want amount but we know that for example imagine LIS LIS is there then these two things should be clubbed up so to overcome this issue grouped by account comma name and did this amount column sum okay as it is a group by object I have done dot reset index to change the name now I want only that amount which are greater than here the amount is the new summed amount the new summed amount should be greater than 10,000 this is a condition I don't but we have three columns if you have seen it account name amount I don't want everything I want only the name and amount column but in the output they want to call it with the new name so we have renamed it to name and balance okay hope it's clear for everyone if you want the code query for this it will be available in this github repository where the readme will be provided with the serial number lead code question number category the link of the URL of the lead code problem the YouTube solution link and the GitHub solution link which is available here okay that repository link will be available in the description below okay you can go here and you can fork it down and if you're further interested in learning data science NLP generative AI stuff or anything data science related stuff please fill in this Google form which is available in the description below and if you are preparing for data science interviews do check out my playlist of project 1 lead code SQL project to lead code pandas it will be greatly helping your interview process and if you have any other questions or doubts regarding the problem which you solved please use this hashtag in the comment section i will try to answer those as soon as possible and until then keep learning guys